Hello everyone, this is Henry Jansen. I haven't made a video in so long on this channel, so I thought it'd be really fun to do a commentary track for none other than The Bachelorette. This has been one of my favorite shows for quite a while. I catch it pretty much every season, except the seasons I don't. And this one really intrigued me with the idea of two bachelorettes. Wow. As soon as you think the drama can't be stopped, they top it. And I am hyped for this season. So this is episode one of season 19, The Bachelorette. So two women dating one group of men. How's that going to work? <laughs> which woman gets to date which guy? Who chooses? And then what happens Two if women, both women dating 18 men. Man? How's that going to go? Honestly, I'm not really sure. But he, I am he, The host doesn't even know. He's, he doesn't even know what he's doing. So, of course, as I go through this season, I'm going to have to update you on which one I like more. Because, I mean, I don't remember them enough to really pick right now, but I'm going to pick a favorite, probably by the end of this episode. Oh my gosh. One dad looks like Tony Soprano and the other looks like great grandpa. He looks like the grandpa in Charlie the Chocolate Factory. Oh, it is her grandpa. Okay, my bad. I'm sorry. Both so deserving of love, especially after everything we went through. What did you go through? There he is. Clayton. Yeah, that was his name. Man, he is stone face. With her. Okay. Let's see what these two queens Just got, got cooking. Colorado, Colorado Springs. I okay. I have to prepare for the bachelorette. So I need to pack, get my together, organize, say goodbye I have to, to prepare for the bachelorette. I gotta pack, I gotta get my dog. So I'm out in the wilderness of Colorado Springs running. As crazy as Sully is, I feel like I'm packed. Is that TikTok song playing in the background? Good night's rest. Oh, you wanna up some hey, I'm on up, I wanna get in, huh? Is she really fixing that airplane? Oh my god, I think that's her. That's what? She's starting. flying a plane Having there? And they just gave her the Jeep? It's truly the best thing that I ever could have asked. Homegirl coming in on the plane. Like oh my, out Rachel, out let's do this. Oh, this is cheeky. This is cheeky. Number one on the cheeky counter. So there are those men. The These are men. The There's just one important question. Some aggressive nipple slapping, Jeez Louise. I'm going to Hollywood. Jacob. Mario. From Illinois. Johnny. Hayden. Hayden, why didn't you film the video horizontally? You put in no effort, bro. Joey and Justin. <laughs> Joey and Justin have absolutely no enthusiasm. <laughs> they look like their parents are setting them off to <laughs> like space camp. <laughs> Erich? Erich? Is that a name? Logan, the videographer, but he shot his video in the bathroom with his iPhone. I normally go for like guys who are like taller, more Tall, athletic. athletic, of course. Um, but yeah, it really just depends on personality. I've never really dated a guy who was like made me laugh. What? Like, humor. I know for it's you, all about it's really the personality. Yeah. I've never you? dated like, a guy that made me have, laugh. Like, a type. But I'm a big personality guy. I've dated the short oh. king. Short king. Short kings rise up. Well, <laughs> as high as you can rise, I guess. <laughs> ones, the dumb ones. Oh my! It so really, you've dated everyone. But Short I'm men, little men, tall men, decision. baby men, old men. I will say Gabby has more personality, I can already tell. Maybe, maybe other lady, I already forgot her name, is probably warming up. But Gabby's given, she's given more material to work with, I'm gonna be honest. After everything with Clayton, men have rightfully earned not being able to be trusted. <laughs> okay, Clayton speaks for all men now. He is our representative. Thank you. I would love, in the end of the show, if one girl gets proposed and the other doesn't. That would be fantastic. Erich. Is it just Eric, but they put an H on the end? Or is it Erich? You, okay, you guys notice this? I know it's in every Bachelor Bachelorette show. The tiles are always so wet. Like, maybe it's because they just got so many plants around there, but... Look how wet it is. It's like they just power washed it. Oh, so they're going to come out and meet them both at the same time. That is so awkward. Because it all comes down to, 
Which one do you hug first? Which one do you kiss first? Which one do you say hi to first? Do you shake both their hands at the same time? This is so exciting. And I just have to say, you two look absolutely phenomenal. I feel like yeah. the luckiest guy. This is like prom if you didn't know your date. It's so awkward, two women, because usually they're like super flirty when they come out, the guys. They usually say something cheeky, like, you know, I'll be the horse to your you know, wagon or whatever. But they can't do that because they got two women. So they can't be like overly flirty. They can't like pick one. There's something I got to get off my chest. I've got something in common with Clayton. Oh no. Oh no, that's not what we <laughs> I'm his brother. I'm in love with three women. Oh. Aww. My mom, my sister, and my dog. Ew, uh, <laughs> that's so oh, that's gross. That's okay. <laughs> I'm in love with my mom, oh my, gosh, my sister, <laughs> and my dog. I don't like that. I, that is so cheesy, bro. <laughs> Who doesn't like dogs? That is not a good line, man. He's my type. <laughs> He's my type because he likes dogs. Who doesn't like dogs? Uh -oh. Noise canceling okay. headphones. I know family is a, a big part of your life. I love this idea. Okay. See, what was I saying? I was saying the biggest problem was that you can't talk to them individually if they're out there together. What do you do? Cover one of their ears. It would have been really funny if he puts the headphones on their ear and then he just craps on the other one. He puts it on their head. I'm going for you. I actually hate this girl. I don't know why I'm here. Switch his headphones. I hate this woman. I'm here for you and you only. Oh, yes. Mario. Dancing. Having two females is I like I that. I like Mario. Getting up there. Looking for his peach and daisy. All right, Ethan's winning. I'm not good at juggling two women. However, I promise you, I could be quite the catch. That's great. His puns cringe me out, but that was cheeky. Number two on the cheeky count. I got two chicks. A couple of my friends. You can make a chick joke. When I there was gonna be two bachelorettes, I figured I should practice hanging out with a couple of cute chicks. Yeah, a couple cute chicks. I love it. So here they are. This is uh Mary Beth. Oh, he named them. He 100% named them two minutes ago. So my name's Hayden, and I know that does sound a lot like Don't like him. Okay. Don't like him. I don't like him, and I don't like his American flag tie. I'm thinking with this head, and not that oh. one. Oh, we appreciate so that. Yeah. Uh, Looks like. Uh, it's I am the not goofy pretty. guy. Popped out a limo in an old black suit. I'm 25, chilling girl. Say I'm Is he cute. rapping? I heard the Johnny last no. man dated, he was kind of a fluke. Johnny, Johnny, no was, papa. Rapping to Gabby, guys, no papa. Whose children are these? <laughs> Who are these children? What's the chance that these kids got paid? Low. Nothing says sexy man like sending out four children dressed like <laughs> dressed like Alfred to come out and serenade you about your ex-boyfriend. Okay, the girl on the left is missing her mark every time I want to say that. How would it feel if at the end of this he goes, these are my four kids. <laughs> these are my four kids. I got to bring them everywhere. They don't get paid. They get to eat all the crumbs that are left in the limousine. That's their payment. All right, Justin Bieber. I mean, Justin B. Comes a lot of, uh, nervous energy. So Please I do magic. Please do magic. A little extra grounded. Ew. I mean, we got Toes a lot of out. Uh, Toes out. out there, Put man. those dogs Stay away. Stolen. You know, these guys have like three brain cells because they all have the same idea. They're like, hands. what if I come hey, out I'm just so excited with a piece of cake and then I say, just like this cake, you're delicious. I like a man that gets me a chair. <laughs> I think Spencer's really cute. And he has great style. Great style? He's Good. wearing exactly what the other 39 men are wearing. A suit with no socks and some loafers. <laughs> oh. No. I see you, Rachel, and... That is so creepy. Yeah, it's pretty good, but now that I met Why is this pillow so sticky? <laughs> No I've been idea. using this pillow every night for the last year. <laughs> oh, okay. I haven't washed it once. Gabby and I were both. Wow, his tie looks like shit. <laughs> who tied it? I wonder who tied that tie. I just want to have a good time, almost like get my feet wet in the sense that I'm dating like multiple. Girl, if you want to get your feet wet, walk out on the wet. 
pavement that they keep spraying down. On your toes for sure. You're at the well, you're most, you're most Bro, honorable. put those when dogs away. Oh, very different. I, for me, for instance, I feel like I'm a little bit more of a laid back, reserved kind of person. A little bit outgoing. He's more of a bold. Yeah, out there bold. Too. bold. Yeah. Okay. He seems so bold with his quiet head nodding. <laughs> Yeah, he's the he's the bald one. Yeah, I'm the bald yeah. one. This man looks like Rango. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and less. Okay. And less. The it's eyes. Really Get this okay. man some you know sleep. English, but this, this is different. Give him some better drill and put him to bed. <laughs> How's it going? Oh my god. Oh, they get a little girl <laughs> sesh. Now I kind of understand how you can have feelings for multiple people. Are you saying you're falling oh my in love with everybody? Everybody! Sounds like the teacher. <laughs> Sounds like the teacher in Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy Neutron! Try and get time with Gabby and Rachel. I think, uh, I think I would rather talk to the real chicks. Bro, what? Has he been holding those the whole night? I'm dying to know your biggest fear. My um, biggest fear? Your biggest fear. Okay, on three, ready? Yeah. I'm gonna say mine too. Okay. One, two, two three, three. Sharks. Clowns. Clowns. Sharks? What if they said something completely out of pocket? My biggest fear is my father. <laughs> that guy looks like Drake Malfoy. <laughs> Draco Malfoy. There you go. What up? Not going out. I can't believe he picked yeah, over me, Potter. Yeah, yeah, he just does look like Draco. Oh, what the punch. heck? Man, he looks like Ashton Kutcher right? when he's on Two and a Half Men. Mario. Mario, my man. Mario. Mario, getting that peach. You know what I'm saying? Over that Toadette situation. Falling in love in Paris. Oh, that's racist, I think. Thank you all for tuning in to The Bachelorette Season 19, Episode 1. And we'll see you guys next week with Episode 2, baby.